Named after the classic Valentino movie about bullfighting, this is the Blood and Sand. It's probably one of my favorite classic scotch cocktails. It's such a delicate balance that the proportions have to definitely be on for it, or one of the ingredients will overpower the other. The Blood and Sand, it's a, it's a great all seasons cocktail. To make the Blood and Sand at home, you'll need a high quality scotch, be it blended or single malt. Some freshly squeezed orange juice, some sweet vermouth, some cherry herring, which is a cherry brandy, and an orange peel for garnish. We're gonna start off by getting a mixing tin. First, we'll add three quarters of an ounce of orange juice. Follow that up with three quarters of an ounce of cherry herring. After that, we'll add three quarters of an ounce of sweet vermouth. Lastly, we'll add three quarters of an ounce of our scotch. Add your ice, cap it off, and give it a really good shake. Strain that all into a chilled cocktail glass. Today, we're using a coupe. Grab an orange peel, give it a good squeeze to express the oils on top of the cocktail, and drop it in. And there you have it, one of my favorite citrus-based scotch cocktails, the Blood and Sand.